Hey guys! Welcome back to Spider-Man! Otherwise known as the game I'm playing when I should be sleeping, so I'm playing a game set in the city that never sleeps, which the city that never sleeps refers to New York City. Yeah. Speaking of never sleeping, I hope you're not sleeping. I hope you're watching this instead of sleeping. You better be. Subscribe, hit that notification bell. Let's do it. You better not be sleeping on this. Nope. You better be watching here and now. All right. Look at that. I don't have many more upgrades to do. In this game, everything will be fully upgraded in no time. Maybe. Are we in danger? So we got a new um mission. I want to say quest because as if it's an RPG. It's an action adventure. Oh, one of these! Spider-Man! So my tracker picked up some more people who were at the party and might have gotten... Uh, you know... This is Ethan Albright, a biochem TA. Didn't show up for class. My software picked him up in a photo. But there's other pics from the same location and he's gone. Still our best shot. I'll try to find the place. Thanks. Alright, we got another... My only lead again. I gotta find this location. The picture shows elevated train tracks. Like the ones up in East Harlem. Hide and go seek, right? Upper elevated train tracks here. Hey, Worth a go. L trains could mean Harlem. Yeah. I get that. <laughs> I played enough of this to know that uh <laughs> how it works. You Spider Man. I talked to Carlos. He felt fine until he got to the barbecue. Whatever happened to him kicked in after the Halloween party. A delayed reaction. That's not good. There could be corrupted walking time bombs all over Manhattan. Or it could be food poisoning. Lee's corruption is frightening. Literally, no one's safe. I'm used to hostile New Yorkers, but this is a whole new level. Good thing I've got Philip on my side. That guy has some impressive skills. In the bedroom. No, just kidding. Woohoo! That's a cat, not a train. I think these tracks are in East Harlem. Woo! Am I there? Are we there yet? This is it. No corrupted students, but it looks like they've been here. Yeah, someone's been here, certainly. Hey, wow. What happened? The maniacs going wild. They were high or something. They ran off up the street. Gotta find them before someone gets hurt a lot worse. Okay. Wow, they're causing damage. Tons of damage. We must stop them. Ah, help! There they are. Time to end this. Help! Please help us! No! The boogeymen are running after us. What are we to do? Web Blossom! People at the Halloween party. Web Blossom! I love it. I haven't needed any more abilities besides Web Blossom. Like, I think I tried to like, guitar one, which is fun. Related to the punk rock outfit. But, uh, seriously. The sooner I get you guys back to normal, the better. It's not as good as Web Blossom. And other things are very specific. Like, you could disable their EMPs when they're doing when they're jumping at the right angle or something 
You can electrocute them if they're standing over water. Door's locked. No time to be polite about it. You can make them bark like a dog when they're petting a cat. You know, it's got to rip the door down. That kind of specificness, which is good. I think if that's it. Yeah. I, I was just drinking my latte. I get about this one time I got mugged, and I, I, I saw this big crowd of people, and it's like someone flipped the switch. You should be fine now. Though maybe you should switch to decaf. You get what I mean. Okay, I think things are sort of under control. Maybe I should put in some Peter Parker time at the lab. Some Peter Parker time, yeah. Yeah, I get what that is. All right, air, file not found. I don't know. I hope. Here's another call of a type I've been getting a lot lately. <laughs> Speak! Mr. Jameson, I want to apologize. I used to think <laughs> you were an alarmist, but look what's happened to the city. I'm afraid to walk the streets. As well you should be. And I accept your apology. It's understandable. You were bamboozled by the mainstream voices telling you everything was dandy. Nothing to worry about. Go out and consume. Don't ask questions. I was a lone voice in the wilderness then, but now more and more people like you are realizing who spoke the truth. And that, my friends, is how we will take our city back. Yeah, I guess. Look at that. Stunning. Like, I, I don't... By the way, I don't have the remastered version, okay? I started playing this before the remastered version came out, and, uh... It, this is not a remastered series. Yeah. Ooh, a nighttime mission. Jameson's right. You put on a big show... But all you do is leave a mess behind for everyone else. What brought this on, Officer Friendly? Fisk is gonna get off. I doubt that. We got decades worth of evidence on the big guy. Not anymore. Evidence truck got hit on the way to lockup. Whatever was on those hard drives is as good as gone. Big Willie isn't getting off that easy. I'll get those drives back. Okay, think, think. All processed evidence has RFID tracking tags applied. I should be able to find the hard drives if I track the tags. Gotta move fast. Oh, I've done this before. Okay. Closer. Warmer, warmer, warmer. So hot. So hot. Just in time. Doesn't look like they've wrecked the drives yet. Time to ruin Willie's welcome home party. Yep, Who's there? that's the plan. Off. Did I do a stealthy thing? Did I do a stealthy thing? Nah. Who cares? Who cares about stealth? Who cares? No one. No one. Stealth games do not exist. You know, there's no need for stealth. Like, name one stealth game, and uh, you won't find any. There's, there's, there's no such thing as stealth games. No. There's only the way I play. This is the only way to play a game. Honestly, though, I occasionally have done stealth. Or occasionally will do stealth. As a rare exception kind of thing. I've seen people fight harder over a new smartphone. I'm getting kinda hungry. Oh my. The drives aren't damaged. Perfect. Shouldn't be now eating. I just need to return this to the Hell's Kitchen precinct. I shouldn't be eating late at night. Alright. Wish I could see Willie's face when he finds out about this. I'll bet he chokes on his prison Bordeaux. Ah, 
I got it. Mr. Officer Friendly. Fisk isn't going anywhere. I've got the missing drives. Wait a sec. So you just happen to know where to find them? Maybe you and the Kingpin really are working together. Wow, wow, really? Steal them and bring them right back? You don't think I have better things to do with my time? Uh-oh. Rockets! Take cover! Oh, no. Isn't there like a... a little overkill, don't you think? Isn't there a sports team called the Rockets? Like, I don't know. I don't know where they would be. Oh, look how they fell off. Let's knock them off the... Ow! They're throwing everything they've got at us! Alright, back down! Woo! Nah, they haven't. They just Welcome. they look at clouds and they see puppies or something. Welcome. Okay. And they'll have to go through me to get to you. Have you ever cloud gazed before? Let me know. I, I haven't cloud. I just look at a cloud and be like, ooh, that's a cloud. You know what it looks like? It looks like a cloud. Nice. It's a big puffy white one. That's a big black that one. That could be it. Mobsters a... carpooling? <laughs> I'll say this for Fist. At least he's eco friendly. What I said yeah. could have been misinterpreted. Um, please don't misinterpret that I was just talking about clouds. <laughs> this is fun. I'm glad I'm playing it tonight. I am super glad. Suggest a food for me. What should I eat late at night? Um, should I have some really hungry? Damn. Some of Fisk's men must have made it up top. What should I eat? Let me know. And I will eat whatever you say. Where are the drives? Go to hell. Wrong answer, pig. Ooh, they're beating up the officer? Ooh, you don't beat up an officer. You don't hurt an officer of the law unless it's GTA 5. It's GTA 5, by all means, hurt officers of the law. Don't matter. <laughs> Seriously though, I haven't, I've never done a full playthrough of GTA 5. I'm talking about like privately. Spider-Man, I'm sorry. I was wrong about you. Jameson can go to hell. Much appreciated, officer. One question. Is it true you're from another world? Yeah. It's called Queens. See ya. Next up... This one. Just because. Even the mole people living in the sewers know about the high-speed chase between police, Spider-Man, and the demons. Once again, Spider-Man makes a bad situation infinitely worse. And we have a highly intelligent caller who agrees with me. You're on with J. Jonah Jameson. Yes, Mr. Jameson. Yeah, I was trying to get to work, and I was almost run over. Look, I understand that Spider-Man saved the kidnapped victim, and I'm glad about that. But I could have been killed. Not just you. This is the problem with that masked mania. The police are able to coordinate efforts, block streets, lay down tire shredding strips, because they're a team. Spider-Man is a one-man show who cares about one thing. Spider-Man. And you almost paid for that. With your life. Whatever you say, Jameson. Agents, this is Control. What's the situation in Longacre? Now, reports are coming in that Martin Lee, along with exhibiting freakish abilities like those of you-know-who, has lately seemed to display almost a split personality. <laughs> this is hogwash and a clear attempt to evade justice for his crimes. Only a fool would believe that he's Mr. Positive one moment, helping the poor with a smile, then suddenly he's Mr. Negative, blowing up... Wait a minute, Mr. 
Negative. That's gold, Jared. Gold. Trademark it. Stat. <laughs> as I was saying, folks, Morton Lee's evil side, or as everyone is now calling him, Mr. Negative, has been revealed as the culprit for the City Hall bombing. Uh, I've heard that is his name. All right, to the lab. We got some lab stuff to do. Hang out with our doc friend. It's gonna be a good time. Ooh. Look at the details. Got a little Spider-Man Venom? Seriously. Hello? Parker! <laughs> Just in time to celebrate. Celebrate? Wait. Where are the arms? Oh, wow. So cool. But how did you... Intracranial neural network. Neurotransmission speeds under one nanosecond. Faster than signals travel inside the brain. Never mind to an external prosthesis. We did it, Peter. No one can take this away from us. Amazing. And your work on the neural web was the key. But we haven't even tested it yet. There's so much we don't know. It works beautifully. Uh, come on, take a look. This is impressive. Hmm. Oh, we're working on him. Error, though. Oh. We got some puzzle stuff. Voltage spike. Should be an easy fix. All right, I'll get back to you when um when I'm near done. I hope editing me knows what they're doing. I want to give you some of the action. It would take up like a whole episode to like show you the every moment of it. It would it would take way too long. I mean, it depends what you want to show. I want to see if that worked. I'm not. I don't pink wave puzzle gamer or anything. <laughs> no, this is worse than I thought. Trademark that. too hard there you go and the voltage needs to be worked on hope that there. stabilized it critical failure what we have is a failure Damn to it, communicate cascading I don't know if I can fix this what we have is a failure to communicate Does everyone uh, have Netflix? I don't have Netflix. I've never had Netflix. I have Hulu. I've never had Netflix Come though. On. Still critical failure. Man, something's wrong. Long term memory. Ouch. Ouch. My friend's not doing well. I guess continue? Uh, not a good feeling. This is bad. Doctor? Doctor, I found a potential problem. Everything has problems if you look hard enough. But fortune favors the bull. Time to show the world what we've done. Otto, the neural web isn't isolating your motor neurons. It could be affecting other parts of your brain, your, your inhibitions, your mood. I, I just think we need some more we've testing. We've got enough testing! For the first time in my life, I don't feel like a failure. I feel like me. Otto, you're not a failure. But this could permanently damage your mind. Please. Don't worry. We're 
close. I'll keep at it. I'll work out some bugs. Go. Go. You sure you're okay? Yes. Thank you, Peter. For... For everything. Martin Lee is now behind bars. When I make a promise to this city, I keep it. The people of New York will soon make a decision that could change the course of this city forever. So when you're casting your vote, remember what I've done. We are all safer now than we have ever been. Liar! You have no idea what you're in for. He's, he's doing fine. Nothing bad going on. I should check on Miles. Hey, Pete. Hi, Miles. I just wanted to see how you're doing with the news about Lee. Look, if you didn't want to work there anymore, May and I would understand. I did want to quit when I heard. Then I remember what my dad used to say. A hero is just a guy who doesn't give up. That's true. Assuming he's doing the right thing. I got you that job. I'd hate for you to keep doing it if you think it's wrong. Oh, the people here. Nothing Martin Lee did is their fault. They need help and I'm helping them. I think Dad would want me to stay. I think he'd be proud. I know he would. And Miles, I'm proud of you too. Anytime you want to talk, just call. Thanks, Pete. Gotta go. May just gave me a list of all the supplies to get. All right, later. Well, nothing too eventful happened this episode. Yes. Uh, leave a like and a comment talking about how uneventful this episode was. Thank you for watching.